Welcome to VKQ, Interest in Adventures, and another of my favorite types of video game pickup videos. Today, I'm going to be showing off a wide selection of video game and video game related items that I've picked up. Most of it, relatively cheap. First thing, I got a dollar store. You've already seen my Mario Oreo videos, but I found these little individual packs. One with Mario and one with Luigi on it. So, figured why not put some food in the video. Next thing, it looks like we won at the arcade. We got a Princess Peach to go along with my Mario, and I think I still need a Luigi, but I have a Bowser, a Boo, Cheap Cheeps, all sorts of plush. Next item, I got this Game Boy looking video game trivia card deck. Now, the story behind this is I took my daughter because I had an e-gift card for Barnes & Noble and it wouldn't load because my Wi-Fi sucked. And I ended up paying for her book out of pocket. I get out to the parking lot, it kicks in, the coupon comes up on my phone, so I walk back in and bought myself something. Alright. I got a canvas print. This one was off of Timu for a couple bucks. So I can put flowers on my wall. Okay. Also off Timu for like I think it was like three bucks. I got one of those uh, what are they called? Jewel painting or 5D jewel painting, whatever. And it's Mario carrying a golden mushroom. I would open it, except I don't want the little jewel stickers everywhere. So. I got a Mega Man manga. An extra nunchuck for my Wii. My grandmother bought this for me at Goodwill. It's an Atari flashback. I still got to test it out, but at that price, it's worth the risk, right? Three bucks. Now, a game swap here in Medford, they got gachapons like in Japan, and I had to get one because, check that out, I got a slime from Dragon Warrior, that's so cool, and he's squishy too, squishy, 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 <laughs> I was hoping for the metal slime, but whatever, I'm cool with that, over the summer, I did some garage sailing, and I wasn't able to show off everything, all these games broke down to being like 10, 15 cents each. They're all pretty scuffed up on the back, but I'm thinking I can have them resurfaced and probably salvage them. So I got Spyro Enter the Dragon, Britney's Dance Beat, Mojo, Gran Turismo 3, The Incredibles, Tetris World, Medal of Honor, Smuggler's Run, Need for Speed Underground 2, and Bratz the Movie, which I believe is the only one I actually don't already own, but if I am able to resurface these, I can use them to trade for something else. And like I said, at 10, 15 cents a piece, why not? I mean, I got the whole stack for a buck. There's one, two, three, four, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So a little over 10 cents a piece. All right, then I got some Wii games. I got Dance Dance Revolution's Hottest Party. Gummy Bears Mini Golf. Wreck-It Ralph. And Rock Blast. On top of that, I got the U Draw Pad for the Wii. And I got this at a garage sale that one of the Sorg members was having. And I ended up getting that for a dollar, as well as these two uh, Super Nintendo games for a buck each at American Gladiators. And Mr. Bloppy Saves the World. 
no idea about a Super Nintendo game for a buck, you don't say no to. Like I said, everything in here, nothing I spent... I think the most expensive thing in here is actually this. Because this ended up running me $4 for the Gotcha Bone. But everything else was like 3 bucks or under. Well, never mind. I think I ended up spending $7 at the arcade of running Ski Ball in order to win this one. 7 or 8 bucks. And I put out a video back when that happened of uh, me being mad when a kid hit me in the head with a basketball and ruined my perfect game. Go check that short out. All right. These are my video game pickups. Comment down below which was your favorite item. Please like, share, and subscribe.